The Hidden Costs of a Cashless Society for Trinidad and Tobago's Poor, an editorial by Professor Wall Street. As Trinidad and Tobago moves towards a cashless society, it's crucial to consider the potential impacts on the nation's most vulnerable populations. While the benefits of digital transactions are often highlighted, the transition could have drastic effects on poor people. Here are 10 reasons why. One, limited access to technology. Many low-income individuals lack access to smartphones, computers, and reliable internet connections, which are essential for participating in a cashless economy. Two, digital literacy. A significant portion of the population may not have the necessary digital literacy to navigate online banking and digital payment systems. This can lead to exclusion from essential financial services. Three, banking fees. Digital transactions often come with fees that can be burdensome for those with limited financial resources. These fees can accumulate, making it costly for poor individuals to manage their finances. Four, trust issues. Many people in low-income communities have a deep-seated mistrust of banks and digital financial systems. This mistrust can prevent them from adopting cashless methods, leaving them further marginalized. Five, cybersecurity risks. Poor individuals are more vulnerable to cyber crimes such as identity theft and fraud. Without proper education and safeguards, they can easily fall victim to these threats. Six, dependency on cash. The informal economy, which many low-income individuals rely on, operates primarily on cash. A shift to a cashless society could disrupt these economic activities and livelihoods. Seven, exclusion from financial services. Many poor people do not have bank accounts due to the costs associated with maintaining them. A cashless society could exacerbate this exclusion, making it harder for them to save and manage money. Eight, economic inequality. The digital divide can widen economic inequality as those who are digitally literate and have access to technology will benefit more from a cashless society than those who do not. Nine, loss of privacy. Digital transactions leave a trail of data that can be monitored and exploited. Poor individuals may be particularly vulnerable to privacy invasions and misuse of their financial data. 10. Emergency situations. In times of crisis, such as natural disasters or economic downturns, access to cash can be crucial. A cashless society may leave poor individuals without the means to cope with emergencies. In conclusion, while the move towards a cashless society in Trinidad and Tobago promises increased efficiency and security, it is imperative to address these challenges to ensure that the transition does not disproportionately harm the poor. Comprehensive public education, affordable access to technology, and robust cybersecurity measures are essential to mitigate these risks and create an inclusive financial system for all.